Yo, what's up everybody? Welcome back to this banger of a video. And today what I have to you is my team for Christian and Playmaker's all time team tourney. So if you haven't heard, Playmaker Gaming and Christian YT are hosting an all time team tournament. And basically in the rules is you have you get assigned a team and you have to make a team using players who have played for that team. It doesn't have to be players that have that are playing on there right now. It has to be and as long as they've played a game for the team, they're eligible to win the team. And I got assigned the Redskins, which I was really upset about at the beginning. But after seeing how the team turned out, I would actually say it's one of the better teams on the tournament. No offense to anybody. And so, yeah, I'm, I'm excited for the tournament. And let's get into it. All right, guys. So the first player on our team is 96 overall Donovan McNabb from the X-Factors promo. So, well, field pass. So... I've actually played with this card a little bit, and I have to say he's amazing. He has good speed, good throwing. He can throw very accurately. He doesn't throw many interceptions, and I think he's going to be a crucial part of the team in order to be able to get far into the tournament and hopefully win it. All right, guys, so the second player on my team is probably the most valuable, which is something I shouldn't be saying because then anyone in the tournament watching this could just game plan against that. But anyways, I got the 94 and I evoed him to 96. And that was probably the best decision because he has 97 speed and 98 acceleration, which is going to be crucial to get against some of the secondaries in the tournament, which are really good. All right, so moving on to our LVP, least valuable player, Deshaun Jackson. The only reason I got this card is because there is no other better receiver that have played for the Washington football team, except for, of course, Terry McLaurin, but I already have him. I'm really going to try not to throw to him unless I really have to. Other than that, he's not really important. Now, our first tight end, Logan Thomas. I got this from the Sugar Rush promo. He's a decent card, and he has good power. So, that makes him kind of good for the team. And hopefully, he'll do good. Next up is this absolute beast of card, Vernon Davis, 95 overall. Evo from his 93. 95 speed, 97 acceleration is going to be amazing. He will really draw some attention away from Terry McLaurin. So if anybody try, they try to game plan against my team, they'll have to worry about them too. And it'll be much harder for them to stop it. Next up, the man, the myth, the legend, 100 overall, Sean Alexander. Amazing card. I've already played with him. He's beastly. He's going to definitely take some pressure off of Terry McLaurin and Donovan McNabb. And of course, Brennan Davis. This is going to be really good. So I don't have to rely on my passing game and risk getting intercepted. And then the last position on my team worth noting is 92 overall Adrian Peterson. The only reason I got him was because I wanted the power and he's a power back. So he's going to really help in fourth and one situation so that I can relax like fullback diver or something. So that way I can get the first down. And just in case you wanted to see the full old line, we have Trent Williams. Wes Schwitzer, Chase Rouillier, Brandon Scherf, and Timon Paris. And that's the offense right there. 87.3 overall with the new update. So, yeah, it's pretty good. Moving on to defense, we have 92 overall, Thanksgiving, primetime, Deion Sanders. Really great quarterback. 93 speed, 93 XL is going to be really good against some of the receivers that I've seen, like Chad Ochocinco or Joe Beckham Jr. He's going to be a good quarterback to shut them down. And next to him, his partner in crime, Kendall Fuller, another shutdown corner. Our secondary actually turned out really good, and he's going to be a big part of that. Hidden in the slot, Mr. Stiff Arm himself, Josh Norman. He's really slow, but his coverage stats are amazing. So hopefully that'll make up for his speed, and hopefully he won't get burnt. And then my last cornerback. Champ Bailey, 89 overall, 91 speed, 92 acceleration, really great. I couldn't find his 93 overall, so that's unfortunate, but this will do just fine. RIP to this man. This guy's a legend, bro. 93 overall, Sean Taylor from the Christmas promo. 90 speed, 94 acceleration is going to be amazing. He has good zone coverage, so hopefully we won't get beaten over the top with some like Hail Mary cheese or something. Next safety, 86 overall, Landon Collins. He's decent. He's not the best, but there isn't another better safety that I could find. So he'll have to do. Ladies and gentlemen, we are running double Sean Taylor. 
Sean Taylor at the safety position, and Sean Taylor at the linebacker position. This card is really similar to a safety card, except that linebacker, so he'll be great. Our second and last decent linebacker, 87 overall, London Fletcher. I evolved him because he's really cheap to evolve, and two overalls higher really couldn't hurt. Then we got 77 overall, Thomas Davis Sr. He's not bad, but he is not competing with the likes of Sean Alexander. Derek Henry. So hopefully he just doesn't do something stupid to lose the game. And then the final piece to our linebacker core, 74 Rob Ruben Foster. He sucks. That's all I have to say. Now at the DM position we have Chase Young, defensive rookie of the year. Hopefully he'll get us some sacks like he did in real life. We have Matthew Ioannidis, 79 overall, one overall away from an elite. So not too bad. And here we have another decent piece of our defense. 86 overall, De'Ron Payne, D-Tackle. I'm going to really hold down against the running game. And finally, the player I'm hoping to win his games in defense, Monsa Sweat. Hopefully he can get some sacks, maybe some fumbles. If he can do that, we can win. All right, guys, so that's our defense. Uh, I think it's also one of the better ones in the tournament simply mostly because of the secondary and our linebackers and defensive line are decent but there's still some flaws some holes that we weren't able to fill and if the other players can find a way to expose that we're in trouble big trouble all right guys and then i didn't know that we had to do special teams until yesterday so this is my special teams, Kai Forbath, Steven Sims, Tressway, and Steven Sims again. Um, I'm not really planning on using the special teams. I don't usually do even with my main special teams. The only one that I might use is Kai Forbath. So I'm really hoping that he's decent enough to make field goals that could potentially win as a tournament. So overall, my team turned out really good. And I'm really happy that's how it turned out. We're an 86.1 overall, which I believe is one of the better overalls in the tournament. I'm excited for this. This is going to be really fun. So make sure to tune in to everybody's streams and watch the videos after at 3 p.m. at Eastern. And I'll see you next time.